viewers libya is a tribal society to a large extent and um, i would say it is the largest tribal nation in arab world her tribes and elders of tribes they have a key role in the running of the government central government and the local governments as well now viewers uh, these tribes they always remained aligned or against the the governments in the past we saw uh, during the rule of umar gaddafi that some tribes were aligned with him and some were against him we are seeing the same thing now that these tribes are divided between gna and lna but majority of these tribes viewers they are aligned with lna what is the reason behind that viewers and which are major tribes in libya in this video viewers i'll have a look at major tribes in western libya and with whom are they aligned and why are they aligned with lna firstly viewers libya is broadly divided into three regions uh, tripolitania which is western libya uh, area around tripoli and to to the west of tripoli then cyrenaica area around benghazi eastern libya then fezzan area viewers sahara desert desert areas here so th uh, three uh, divisions of libya basically and when we talk about western libya uh, largely it means uh, tripolitania region uh, viewers tripolitania region western libya it is less tribal than eastern libya uh, the, the cyrenaica region cyrenaica region is more tribal and this uh, uh, tripolitania region it is less tribal Uh, perhaps that explains uh, more influence of lna in cyrenaica than in tripolitania viewers now here tripolitania in western libya viewers there are several major tribes but majority of them they are aligned with lna firstly viewers tarhona tribe uh, this tribe it has been aligned with lna because when lna forces were deployed at tripoli airport it was alkaniyat the private militia of tarhona tribe which was at tripoli airport this alkaniyat militia it took over a tripoli international airport and facilitated the deployment of lna forces around tripoli the hona tribe viewers it is a combination of several sub tribes and it is still aligned with lna we know that a siege it has been going on by gna of tarhona but tarhona is still aligned with lna then viewers zintan and rijban both uh, areas uh, to to the west of tripoli these two areas uh, these two tribes they are also aligned with lna uh, though we heard some news that now zintan is has decided to be neutral but so far uh, no clarification from them what is their strategy but in the past they have remained aligned with lna we saw fighters from zintan that they fought alongside lna forces both on tripoli fronts and uh, in alwatia as well when alwatia was uh, uh, conquered when alwatia was taken over by gna we saw that fighters of zintan they also would do from alwatia to zintan so these zintan tribe it has also been aligned with lna along with rijban viewers then we was the other tribes like uh, uh, misrata misrata is aligned with the gna and this tribe it has always been in the past as well anti muammar gaddafi so now it is aligned with uh, gna and the majority of people in misrata viewers they are of turkish origin as well so they are comfortable with turkey uh, more than other uh, tribes and more than other uh, ethnic uh, groups here then we was warfla tribe which is the largest tribe in libya it is based in bani walid bani walid as you know it is aligned with lna 
and uh, it is situated on a very important supply route of Hefter forces. Supplies to Tarhona, they pass through this uh, area, Bani Walid. And Bani Walid is the center of this Warfula tribe. It is also aligned with LNA. So, viewers, you see that most of the tribes, most of large tribes in um, uh, Western Libya, in Tibritania region, they are aligned with uh, LNA. And the reason behind that is uh, after the removal of Muammar Gaddafi, we saw that several uh, smaller groups, several smaller factions, they emerged. And the authority of these tribal uh, leaders, it was endangered. Then uh, LNA came and these tribes, they worked in collaboration with LNA to get rid of those smaller groups.